What's up, party people? Uh, okay, I'll never say that again. But this is Le this is Archon Mage. We're welcome to episode 90 of The Legend of Zelda: Ocarina of Time. Let's go up there. Now we're gonna fight this awesome boss. But who could it be? Well, I assume that you already know. Look at that stupid kid. He came on his own to offer himself as a sacrifice to the great Ganondorf. Their voices change. Ooh, spooky. What are you doing? With my flame, I will burn him to the bone. Ooh, flaming hair much. Jeez. And with my frost, I will breathe him to his soul. Oh, God. Icy hair. What? Jeez. What's going to go on here, man? This is... Sorcerer's Sisters. Wind anyway, so we're gonna have to use our mute. Nope, put a, put that away, Link, because you can't use our shield like that. But basically, you gotta use your mirror shield here. See, one of them is going to eventually, just like this, make a symbol like that. Hold out your mirror shield when she does that. And you're trying to hit the other, like the opposite sister, with that beam that gets reflected off your shield. So, yeah. See, now the fire one is going. So we're gonna pull our shield again and try and hit that ice one wherever she may be with it. And you have to do this just quite a, f quite a few times, actually, so this could this battle could drag on for a while. I'm letting you know right now. Because a lot of this is actually based on pure luck. Because you never know where they're gonna be at what time. Alright, oh, hello. Bam! What are you doing? Oh, gotcha. Got each of them once now. Awesome sauce. Yep, so this is probably one of the actual harder bosses of the game, I think. It's harder than pretty much anything we've faced so far. In my opinion, it's going to be the longest boss battle, probably. I don't know how long exactly. Hopefully not the entire video, because that would fail. Alright, someone do some- There you go. There you go. Now let me hit you. Tomorova. Kume, Kotake, whatever, whichever one you are. <gasps> what the? Oh, oh god. I'm gonna hit you. I'm gonna hit you with your own laser. Or not. Alright, come on. Do something, please. There you go. See? Was that so hard? Oh no, you used Ice Beam. I must kill you now. Ha ha. Pwned you. So I'm not sure how many times you have to do this. I think you have to eat, hit, hit, hit each sister twice, or like a total of four hits at least. I think. Don't, don't quote me on that though. Ah! How did I miss? What the hell? That was retarded. Link, link. Oh, you're going again. Okay. Whatever. Dude, 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 dude. Link. What the fuck? Here it comes. Ice beam. Raw. Hit you. I will hit you. Gotcha. Let's see. Is that done? Oh, what's happening? Do we beat it? Okay, let's get serious now, Kotaki. Oh, okay, Kumi. Kotaki, double diamond attack. Jesus Christ, what the boobs? I mean, what the hell? Alright. Ah, uh, hold on just a minute. Sorry about that room ruining of the epicness guys but my sister just told me to quiet down because I yelled or talked rather loudly for that last little bit so hopefully it will matter now all right oh god I just reset my timer um oh well there's about four minutes so okay here we go let's do this now this stage is a little bit more di difficult in my opinion see this you have to keep your lock on her and she'll fire either fire or ice just like this, and it'll eventually charge up in your shield, and your shield gets all awesome and reflecty like that. It's pretty sweet. And you have to charge up three, like, three different beams, and it'll, and then it'll hit her like that. And then you just run up, and slash her with the sword. Just spam the button. Hell yeah. And Link, you missed. A lot. And yeah, basically you have to get up three charges of one different kind. So either three charges of fire, or three charges of ice. Oh god. Damn it. That was lame. That does a lot of damage, too, man. 
Alright, come on. Oh, it's because my, my sword is out, dude. You can't use your shield when your sword is out. Damn it. How did I forget that? Alright, come on. Yeah, so, and if you get, like, if I, like, I have a fire charge right now, so if I were to get an ice charge, I think it would, like, negate that. I think I'm gonna actually go for ice now. Or maybe. Maybe not. Ah! Fucker. You're screwing with me, twin, twin Rova. Fire something. There you go. Sweetness. Yep, and basically this is just rinse and repeat now. Gotta try and get three charges of the same element. And you'll be set. But jeez, there's not much to talk about in this boss battle. Oh god, avoid that. Yeah, not much to talk about in this boss battle. Just do it over and over and over again. I don't think really m many people have much trouble with this portion of the boss. It's just long and tedious. And it's still, it's still kind of luck-based, just like the first part of the fight, because you, you have to wait for her to fire whichever one she's going to do. There you go. Is that so hard? And hit you. Awesomeness. And now just slash you. Ponzor, Ponzor. And you're dead. Oh, yeah. And you go like, You hit me in my boobs. I hate you so much. What the hell? Fire and ice wisps? What, what's happening? Oh. <gasps> They're like all bug-eyed. Of course, they, were, they weren't they were non-bug-eyed before. Phew, what a fresh kit. This time we'll get serious, okay? Kotake, what? Hey, Kumi, what is that above your head? Oh my god. Halos? Halo reaches? Dude, they're going to heaven. How are they going to heaven, man? You're only 400 years old, and I'm just 380 years old. Between us, don't lie about your age. You must have gone senile. Who are you calling senile? Is that how you're your old sister? Hey, we can be twins. How are you older? Yeah, you're heartless. You are. How can you be as ungrateful? You're heartless. You're ungrateful. And. Whoa! I'll come back to haunt you. Which one was saying that? Maybe both of them? I don't know. But, that is the end. That is the final boss. Don't forget to pick up your heart container now. To fill up our entire heart gauge. 20 hearts. Look at that. So anyways, that was kind of an epic boss battle, in my opinion. One of the more epic ones, actually. Not the most epic, but... So let's encase ourselves in the blue rupee and get the hell out of here. So, so now what? Like, that was the last temple. We've gotten all, what, seven medallions now? Six, seven, yeah, six medallions. So, what, what, and who's going to be the sage of this temple anyways? We don't actually have the medallion. <gasps> now, Buru! Dude, I thought it was going to be Ganon. He's the only Guru we really knew. Kid, let me thank you. Heh heh heh. Look what the little kid has become in the past seven years. A competent swordsman. By the way, I really messed up. I was brainwashed by those old witches and used it by Ganondorf to do his evil will. But isn't it funny that a person like me could turn out to be the sage of spirit? That is kind of funny. Ha ha. And now I'm going to fight them as one of the six sages. Heh <laughs> heh. I'm gonna pay them back for what they did to me. You, well, as you should. They imprisoned you for like freaking forever. Argon, the hero of time. Nice to hear you call me by my appropriate title. Instead of keeping the promise I made back then. What promise? I, you're gonna give me this medallion? Yeah, like she talks about the promise there. I, I don't know what promise she's talking about at all. I don't know, maybe someone could enlighten me on that. Because I've never understood that line. Like... I should, I should just keep promise, but whatever. We got the spirit medallion. Hell yeah. Orange. Freaking orange. You know, the annoying orange. And, what's she gonna say here? If only I knew you'd become such a handsome man. Oh, you. You silly. I should have kept the promise I made back then. Well, see, see, there go there she goes again with the promise, but whatever, man. And... <gasps> Argon, the hero. 
Finally, all of us, the six sages, have been awakened. The time for the final showdown with the King of Evil has come. Look at my eyes. Look right into my big fat blue eyes and my big fat head. And before that, but before that, you should meet someone who's waiting for you. The one who is waiting for you. The one who's waiting for you at the Temple of Time. Hallelujah. He raises his arms all epically like that, and it's like, what the hell are you doing, man? But yep, there it is, people. Look at this. Full inventory screen. And full equipment screen. Full quest status screen. Full everything, man. All 100 sculptures claimed. Speaking of which, we have some time left in this video, and but not enough time to really start the next sequence of events. So, um... Let's go to Kakariko Village, Kakariko, and we'll find out what our reward for all 100 Skullshillas is. Like, we got nothing better to do, and we don't want to do that like ha like after we start off our epic journey to fight Ganon. Well, I guess this is kind of ha this is this entire LP has been our epic journey to fight Ganon. What are you smoking, dude? But yeah, I guess like I want to do this before. We go, we finish our epic journey. The fight again. But anyways, like, what could this possibly be, this reward for 100 gold sculptures? Like, we have no more room left for items. Unless it's, like, an up item upgrade or something. We have no room left in, like, for anything, really. We have all the heart pieces. We have all of everything, pretty much. What could he possibly give to me that has any value of any sort? Well, dude... Why don't you tell me? Why are you so ugly? God damn. Since you destroyed 100 spiders of the curse, the curse on me has been broken. Thank you. Here is a token of my appreciation. Please take it. And the most epic thing ever is... <gasps> what? You know what? I'm gonna rage quit now. And <laughs> screw this. You know what? Next up, so we're gonna. I don't. I don't know what we're gonna do. Up to. You know what? This is Argon Matrix. I'm. Oh. Uh, I'll get in a positive mood just to wish you goodbye. Thank you, everybody, for watching. Mm, good, big stretch there, Link. Nice. Whatever. This is Argon Matrix signing out. Thank you, and good night.